So I'm climbing up Cheddar Gorge, which is in Somerset. It's quite like a large area, but it's quite nice. It's world's, uh, I think it's Britain's biggest gorge. But I'm going to try getting up this here. You can see behind me, and take an image just at the top. I'm going to try getting as close as I can to probably that summit there and just take an image after that but it's a really nice place right now um, currently no one's around here so if there is any any non-expect areas or places I can't go I probably should be able to get in there so I'm going to turn it off and then go up there and then you'll see me later okay so I found a good location it's just come to like your golden hour so the, the light's quite nice and soft right now, so I'm, I'm getting good sky to uh, subject ratio of lightness. Um, so I've taken a couple shots. Um, I ditched the 20 to 35 originally because I was going to go with the 20 to 35 because it's quite a nice and wide angle. But now I'm thinking, uh, now I'm thinking, I'm using the Sigma uh, 7300. So if we'll just have a look down there, that's the 7300 on my NEX5. So if I just go and show you what I've done so far. So this was the last composition I've just done before. So if I go into my gallery and just show you. Right, so that was what I did before and I'll, I'll pop that up on screen when I can. Before, go before, that was obviously, I, there was a uh, watchtower, like if you've anyone seen the game uh, Firewatch. I got that kind of feeling from it. So I went through, did that, no ND filters, but then this is the enlarged one. I'm not too sure about this one, but it should look nice if I stitch it and then put some dehaze into it into Lightroom. But, so that's uh, basically what I've got so far. Um, I might hike up a little bit more. Depends on the access really, because I've, I've, I've kind of gone up the wrong one. I should have gone up the other one and saw if I could go up the Firewatch. Because if I go up the Firewatch, that probably would have been a better idea. But, I'll stick with it. I'll see if I can get a panoramic. Because I think a panoramic with a 7300 might look nice. So, I'll skip to that when we can. Okay, so update. I went up the top. I can't get past. There's a massive hedgerow. And I went up the footpath. And great, they locked the gate. So I couldn't really get on that. And they also bolted the gate closed. So I couldn't really open it. Or I couldn't go over it. So, a bit of a problem there. So what I'm going to do is go back to my car. Um, set my tripod, which I've got here, um, and then what I'm going to do after that is set up some long exposure. I've got some ND filters in my bag, uh, some polarizers, and what I'll do is set some long exposures, and then see if we get some light trails. Seems like a good idea. This place is really nice. So you, if, you, if you've never been to Somerset and you've never been to Cheddar Gorge, you've got to come here. It's probably the best place out there. Uh, you get things like little uh, waterfalls, you've got that cave, uh, cave diving, cave, cave climbing, there you go, climbing. Yeah, I couldn't say that was a mouthful. So I'll, I'll go over to the scene which I'm doing the long exposures and I'll show you. Alright, so... Did a little bit more shooting I did with both the 7200 and I got to use my wide angle finally. Um, around the gorge, if you see here, some lovely areas, also some lovely hilltops. So, using the 7200, you can really compress the uh, I mean, 7300 angle, 7200. Um, you can really compress the perspective of something and put emphasis on uh, certain rocks. And I like to use the rule of thirds really. I love it really much. Um, lean lines is nice as well, but you it's, sometimes lean lines in the sort of, uh, sort of roads you want to avoid because they can kind of disrupt the landscape. So I normally leave them out, but what I'm doing is walking back to my car because I'm going to do some long exposures and really just sit in the car for a little while, see how it goes. But the final bits of light have gone down, so we'll see how it goes. Thank you. 